Hey there, how's it going everybody? It's Dan from PlantAbundance.com. Today I wanted to share with you guys the amazing results that I'm getting after converting a traditional front yard lawn to a drought tolerant alternative lawn that self feeds and produces annual and perennial flowers. The Florida de Lawn is a herbaceous flowering lawn that stays green with very little care. The seed mix contains eight varieties of seeds including dwarf grasses, strawberry clover, micro clover, sweet elysium, dwarf yarrow, English daisies, and baby blue eyes. Because the mix contains nitrogen fixing clovers that naturally self feed the lawn and the low growing flowers, other than in the very beginning you're not going to need to get out there and do any fertilization. From afar the lawn just looks like your typical standard lawn that you would see in any urban area but as we get a little closer here you can see all the different varieties of flowers and clovers that are growing throughout the dwarf grasses. Also referred to as a mowable meadow, this lawn has only been watered once in the last four and a half weeks. Also I haven't even fertilized other than in the very beginning I used some slow feed pellets and some compost tea. Not to embarrass anybody, I won't take any pictures, but I'll let you know there's several homes in the area that have automatic sprinklers that go off every single morning and their lawns still appear brown and dry. You can see I'm getting completely different results here. Now I got to attribute part of this to the fact that I got a big shade tree in the front yard. So if anybody's considering redesigning their yard, I would also consider putting in a nice shade tree in that design as well. That's definitely going to help you cut back on the water and, and get the same results that I'm showing you here. Some other benefits to having a drought tolerant alternative lawn are, one, it makes a great spot to get grounded. Research indicates that electrons from the earth have antioxidant effects that can protect your body from inflammation as well as many well documented health consequences. Number two, pets love to play and roll around in the lawn as you can see my dog Happy here enjoying herself. And three, the local wildlife benefits from having an all organic herbaceous lawn in the front yard. Here's some wild turkeys making their way through the yard, enjoying some of the flowers, grasses, and insects that have gathered. So that's it guys, just wanted to share it with you. I hope it inspires you guys to maybe transition if you're still watering that lawn. It's time to uh, maybe look at things from a different perspective here. Uh, I'm located in California. We're dealing with one of the worst droughts in history right now. So anything that we could do to lessen that impact is going to be beneficial not only to ourselves, but to the community. So. That's it guys, hope you're having a great day and hope you're out in the world planting abundance in your life. I'll be talking to you guys again soon, take care.